Hello everyone, welcome back to HubSpot Training. My name is Paulo and today we'll be looking to some of the main features we'll be using on our HubSpot platform. HubSpot simplifies marketing by pulling together everything we need to grow our business into one easy cloud-based software. It's cloud-based because we're not storing any of the information locally on our computer. The information is stored in a server on the internet, so that makes it cloud. So we have here the context and the conversations tab. That will be your bread and butter you'll be using most frequently. Underneath contacts, you have contacts and companies. Contacts, that will be an individual. So that could be a lead, a prospect, a learner, a client, anything, anyone that will fit in the category of an individual. Underneath that, we have companies. So that's information about the company itself. It could be the email, the LinkedIn page, website, number of employees, anything that would help us to identify the company. Activity feed, that will be a, a dashboard. Once you have LinkedIn, your Outlook and your calendar to HubSpot, that will give you a nice display of uh, what's happening for you during the week or during the day. We're gonna be covering that on a separate video, so don't worry about it for now. Lists. That is where we can segment all of our clients uh, to make them into individual categories for better marketing. Don't worry about that for now as well, as we cover in a separate video. Next to contacts, we have conversations. Conversations uh, underneath we have inbox. So that is uh, all of the messages that we have connected. So at the moment we have Facebook Messenger and all that is comes to uh, this tab here on inbox so you can keep track of all the conversations into a single point which is very useful chat flows that is where you can conf configure some of these chats like the chat we have for the for the website don't worry about that for now as uh, things are already set up snippets these will be very useful as you're building emails as you can use hashtags to pull up paragraphs when you type an email so if you imagine a snippet as a lego block that you can pull up easily using in a hashtag and that will pull the whole paragraph as you type in the email so that could help you save a uh, quite a bit of time a template it's similar to an outlook template if you have used in the past it will be a pre-made email that you can use as a uh, as an answer for a query or a particular uh, question someone is uh, com comes to you so you can just use a template to instead of writing the the email again so those are the two main tabs you'll be using guys on the next video we're going to be looking to how to add and remove and edit a contact